Hi there, this is Abrar from Doric and in this video I will show you how you can add an image slider to your Doric website. So here I am on my website and I have three empty columns here as you can see. So let's say I want to add an image slider in this column here. So I will click on add element and there if I scroll down I will find the option for image slider. So I'll click on that and boom an image slider will appear on my website. So here is how you can edit and adjust your image slider in your website. I'll show you step by step. So here I am on the first option which is the images option. I will expand that. So then here as you can see I have three of my images as appeared. Now let's say I want to change an image. Uh, so I'll click on this drop down here and click on delete. So this image will disappear. Uh, let me show you that on my website. See it has disappeared. Now I'll click on add new image and I'll add an image from my desktop. And there you go. It has been added. Now let's say I want to add another image. So I'll go to caption 2 and replace that. And boom. My second image has been added. And on the third image I want to add a URL. So how do I do that? Let me show you. So here I am on Google search. I will go to this link over here. And I will right click on this image and click image in open image in new tab. Here I am on this tab and I will click on copy image address. Then I will go back to my builder and paste this URL right here. So this is how you can add an image from a new URL. You can also change the captions here. So this caption will be puppies. And you can add a link, a URL to this image if you want. You can also change it to open a new tab. So the URL opens in a new tab in your browser. You can also add more new images with this option right here. You can also duplicate or delete an image according to your needs. Next we have the option settings. So let's expand that. You can change the slider height over here. Yeah, looks better that way. You can change the direction of how this uh, image slider works, which direction it is moving. Is it left to right or right to left? You can also change the slider behavior. You can change it to just slide. You can also change it to a loop so it keeps on moving. You can adjust the slider speed from 0 to 1000, how fast it moves. You can also change the setting to slider per page. So there is one slider in this page. I can change it to two, just like that, or three. So, okay, so I have three images, not more than that, so I cannot do more than that. So I can actually, but this will look like this. Let's keep it to two now. You can also change the slide per move. You can also change the gap between those uh, slides like that, as you can see. You can turn on autoplay, so this will keep playing. Uh, and then you can change if sh this should have arrows. So if I turn off arrows, as you can see, the arrow is gone. I can turn on dots or turn it off. So if I turn off dots, the dots will disappear. And if I turn it on, they appear again as you can see you can also change the filters in your image you can edit them if you want you can adjust the hue rotate the saturation brightness and all other settings you can also change the opacity of the image slider you can also add a blur effect to your images you can also change the caption style right you can show captions or turn them off so remember when we changed the caption of this picture. So yeah, that was the caption. You can also hide it on mobile or tablet. You can change the caption type to overlay on hover or just default. You can change the text size of your captions, as you can see. You can change the text alignment to the left or right or center. You can change, adjust the color of the caption. Let's change it to white. Uh, there you go. You can also change the background style of your caption. Right now, this is just like that. 
right now this is just gray so let's give this a gradient and boom gradient appears looks good that way uh, you can also change the or adjust the gradient types so that's basically it this is how you can add an image slider and adjust it on your site according to your needs if you have any more further queries you can let me know in the comment section or check out our documentations also contact our support team links are always given on the description down below thank you for using Doric